Right, ladies and gents, a very smart looking XK. Um, I like this limited edition model. This is the S, uh, which means it has obviously a load of S bits, some extra flares, some extra wheels, extra goodies, extra badges, um, and they're just, they look, they look that, that bit, um, what's the word? Sort of like, I don't know, just that, that they sit better on the road. They, they, look, they look nicer. They look a little bit more aggressive, a little bit more finished um, as a lot of the run out models of any car did, didn't they? They put some extra goodies on and those run out models always look nice. Um, before I forget, I have a tendency too. We've got some paperwork here. Now it's, as I said, it's the 4.2 uh, S. Uh, one of the last 500 built here says my notes with obviously 20 inch rims BBS alloys three owners 17 stamps in the book uh, a Mixture of Jaguar and specialist and there's the book there with all the stamps in um, Private number plate obviously which goes with the car. So look, a lovely load of stamps in the book there uh, some 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 uh, extra keys and then some um, previously issued MOTs by the looks of things and invoices and so forth uh, and odds and sods in there. I don't know if there's MOTs or if it's just, I'm just doing it with one hand. Oh, there is. So, yeah, there is some previously MOTs, but mainly some issues and things. Um, that one there, I think, is a relatively recent one. Yeah, at 95,400, it had 1,200 pounds worth of expense there. Um, now the the owner tells me that um, it's been maintained uh, very well. So ninety five thousand four hundred, and it's now where are we? It's now ninety five thousand eight hundred. So there we go. So recently had a nice bit of maintenance work there. I think I've already had a look around the engine compartment and that with you. So that can go down now. Uh, inside, wise. Nice color combination. Charcoal and silver. Nice and smart in there. Nothing to report on any bit a little bit on that bolster there just that wants a little bit of coloring look on that corner but i mean we are that is nothing isn't it really the splitting airs a bit there really uh, in the boot the usual jaguar cd system there first aid kit by the looks of things warning triangle possibly uh spare wheel jack and brace and so forth and then the hood cover which i just laid on the floor here just so I could lift up. Yeah, so we've got a hood cover there as well. Pop that back in. Oh, there's your warning triangle. Must be something else down there. There you go. So that's the hood area. Sorry, that's the boot area. Again, same on the near side. Some Jaguar bumps there. Looks really nice inside there. And then... Uh, We've got, uh, yeah, all good. 17 stamps, last serviced at about 500 miles ago with that. Uh, it's the white badge model. I'm not up to speed with that, so I won't even pretend. But obviously it's the last of the line, as it quite clearly says that. And it does look the part. We'll come to the outside in a minute. Let's, uh, I haven't done it as yet, but let's have a look at the hood. I assume you're going to need handbrake on, I'm guessing. Oh, there you go. Something's happening. Let's see where we are with the hood. There she goes. Back nicely. Fab. So that's your hood, guys. I won't bother putting the cover on because um, I'll probably put the, the hood back up so it doesn't crease. But uh, there you go. They're a lovely looking car, aren't they? And these extra little bits of trim. I'll finish them off. Arguably the one to get. Last of the line. S, limited edition. 
I can see these going up and up and up. I really can. And uh, it's going to be models like this that are going to be the sought after ones with all the bells and whistles in it. A little bit like Brooklyn's Capri's then. You know, two litre lasers do okay. Brooklyn's, they're the ones everyone wants, aren't they? And this will be the case for this car. You wait and see. So, um, anyway. Have a little slow walk around for you. Now the idea of these videos are just to give you an idea of what we've got. And then you can uh, come down and have a look, can't you? A couple of little marks there. You can come down and have a look. Make sure it's one for you. So there you are. Looks out of a car. Drove in yesterday. Uh, I tried to get it photographed last night, but I just ran out of time. It was getting late. We're getting a bit tight for room. So anyway, there you are. It's here. We've got three weeks until the next sale. Uh, we always have a selection of XKs, uh, XK8s and XKRs. There's another one that just sat behind it over there, a blue one, another convertible. There's normally a nice little selection, another one over there I can see. So it's worth a trip because it's... Um, you might come down thinking you fancy a blue one and you might want a silver one or you might come down thinking you want an XK8 and you go on with a Audi convertible I don't know um, but whichever come down have a look if you're making a purposeful trip guys just touch base with the main office um, just in case something something's gone wrong something crazy COVID times and things and everything uh, but come down have a look see what you think in the meantime I'll take some more photographs for you